Hello! We're nearing the end of a very long journey. This might be the final exclusive preview of new content being worked on that's coming to Day of Dragons before their 1.0 release in 2024. There were thousands of you that showed up to see the first reveals of brand new never before seen creatures. You got to witness the official Day of Dragons trailer. Over a thousand of you entered for chances to win dozens of prizes during the giveaway. And you also got to watch some work in progress gameplay of new content. I was part of a small group that was given exclusive access to a developer level that had new stuff in it. So I brought my friends in and we decided to explore the new content over the entire night and then I condensed that entire night down to this shorter video. 2024 might not have a day of the dragon, but it might be the year of dragons. Let's jump in. So we have a new dragon, new abilities, new effects, and a remastered world to explore. Me and my friends jumped in eager to check out the bioluminescent dragon and its newly added ability to make other dragons glow with its bio breath. Bio blast, bio whatever. Anyways, it was really cool. We spent a little bit of time on this. We think you're gonna love it. Yeah, There's oh no god, that was bright. Wow, that was really bright. Oh and my then, god. Hey, hey, look. <laughs> you're drooling. So press Q, I'm kind of curious if it'll overlap. Oh, it's back again. Oh yeah, that's pretty sick. Whoa, that's cool. They gave it like a skeleton. <laughs> <laughs> that's, uh, that's pretty sick. So cool. Wayne ready. Do some of your emotes. I think you have like up to seven or eight. Oh wow, imagine a pack of those chasing Ooh. after you. Scary. <laughs> Especially looking like that. No, thank you. That's terrible. <laughs> that's cute. That's cute. <laughs> Who wants the ball? Who wants the ball? <laughs> That's I a, thought, is that, a I thought that was a bio dragon. I was so confused. Yeah, that's mine. That yeah. sounds like me. Oh, your glow is gone. Glow again. Ooh. You're like a puppy. <laughs> I don't probably want to spit on you. I'm going to spit on you anyways, but. Spit on me. Wow. I love the glow <laughs> on it. The glow is so <laughs> nice on it. No, wait. Let, let me do my. Uh, let me do my. The little. Your throat sack. <laughs> <laughs> that's pretty cool so it's it's kind of unfortunate but the sound isn't hooked up for that guy right now um but if you do use your one key i can just kind of splice it in and make it work <laughs> you look amazing oh that's so cool i love the yellow i love how they're different colors you know i want to know what what it flying from a distance looks like oh i'm just gonna chase after you in the sky it's a flying rhino it's so Heavy to fly, and I You're love really it because it like too. it feels heavy. Oh God, I almost crashed into you. <laughs> <laughs> you look amazing flying through the sky like that. Yeah, you do. That is so Especially sick. On the ground. Oh, oh, no. oh, oh! You messed up. You I messed up. Crash. I do want to see a bit of the map too at night, just to see what it looks like. Man, you, oh my God, the uh, the ground underneath you glows slightly oh, as you fly shoot. by. Oh, and you, well, the water's glowing now. <laughs> it's really cool and even practical to be able to have an ability so your friends can glow at night so you can keep track of them, or even if you're hunting something. A bio dragon offers a pretty substantial benefit to its existence. We decided to mess around for the rest of the night, and I was able to do something pretty cool. Okay, all right, I got it lined up. Uh-oh, 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 you're going up. I don't know if I hit you then yeah, or not. I hit that's you? Oh! Cool. <laughs> oh, that's so cool. <laughs> that's pretty sick. Uh-oh. 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 I'm falling. Oh, he fell off. He fell off. <laughs> I'm fine. I'm fine. Unlike you guys, I don't have skill issues. All right, they're going to make a day, so we'll actually see a day <laughs> transmission with a <laughs> transition, not transmission. Transmission. I'd there. prefer transmission. Holy crap, I couldn't actually see you 3d until you started glowing <laughs> oh wow did it just get really dark for anyone else yeah yeah it's like real dark oh it's there's a storm so it's kind of like they have weather vision. set up on this Ooh. oh that is so cool my, oh my god the bioluminescence is making the rain glow i love that so Ooh, weather is just as intense yes. in this game as it is in the aisle and you guys were freaking out over the thunderstorms and stuff for the aisle it looks I just as good i think was. Oh, that's awesome. Oh, it lights up the whole map. Oh, <laughs> that is nice. so insane. <laughs> that's crazy. Oh, it's so bright. Uh, you can't see the rain much, but 
once the lightning hits, you just see it all. Oh yeah, it's just That's... coming right at you. Uh -huh. Yeah, the it's amazing. It's glowing for me, like the bioluminescence is making it glow. Is it really? And you're on low settings? Oh. Yeah. I don't even want to try and fly in this. Like, flying in this would be bad. <laughs> I can't fly during the day, right? <laughs> okay, Kiwi's gonna go try and do it and... I hope you get hit by lightning. <laughs> I hope a big Imagine bolt that. just comes down like Zeus. <laughs> <laughs> it just gets electrocuted, that's it. Man, that lighting is so good though when it when it starts flaring up. I'm gonna I'm gonna try flying. I'm just I'm gonna give it a shot. We should be able to actually like fly up high enough to be above the storm. Oh. I think we can should fly we try? into I'm doing it right now. I'm trying to at least. Uh, we should be able to get right up into the clouds. That would be so good. Yeah, like, can... I'm getting close to the clouds right now. I can already see it. This is intense, man. Yeah, this is like hurricane. So I remembered in the previous build, this is something that I tried. And weather wasn't really set up as well or perfected as well as it is now. And it is surprising when I get up above these clouds. Was the they... storm done? Is the storm done? Oh, we're just above it. Oh, oh. Above it. I'm way- Oh, oh God! Oh, no, wow! Done. A oh, rainbow. What? Oh, a rainbow? that is sick. The rainbow's upside down underneath me. Oh, I see it. <laughs> the rainbow's upside down underneath me. I think I'm too high into the sky. <laughs> but it's there. <laughs> I'm that was intense. That was actually pretty sick. Oh, I could see the rainbow the way it was intended now. <laughs> I can, you know, that's so crazy because like we I was seeing a lot of the stuff on the aisles like wow you know the, the lighting and the, the thunder and the rainbows that's so cool but like they've got this stuff here this, this must be like an Unreal Engine 5 thing or something that's just like kind of built into everything Super that Rhino the really. Firstborn what Super Rhino is the owner and main developer for Day of Dragons Anyways, now it's time to move into the Brood Watcher, its animations, and its sounds. It was previously known as the Nurse Dragon. I like Brood Watcher a lot more. Please keep in mind, this is still a work in progress test, so its sounds aren't hooked up, so I'll be overlaying all of the sounds that I've gotten from the developers in this video, so you can at least hear what it would sound like. I don't have all the sounds, but I have a lot of them. That's the broadcast. You just close your eyes completely and belt it out. <laughs> the scream. All right, this is the Threaten, is number two. Okay, yeah, you're right. The Threaten on this feature, too, it sounds insane because, like, it's completely different compared to the normal sound sets. It's just like, hear. get away from my eggs. This is friendly. Oh, yeah, little hops. Little, little stompies, little bear stomps. I think this is the uh, fear one? Yeah, that's definitely fear. So what are the other ones, five through nine? I don't know. Number five, I think, was the mating display or something. Yeah, that's the mating dance. With the, the throat sack stuff. <laughs> like, <laughs> I'm, I'm going to ask if I can get the sounds for that and pair that in, too, if I, if I can while that's already in, but... This is six. Don't know what this is. Yeah, I don't know what. The, I think that's just like a this normal. This is seven. Normal is seven. Idol. Oh wait, I can. I you can wag your look. Tail. Seven. Wait, give me a second. Seven. Okay, so six is affection. Seven is mourning. Eight is challenge. Nine is rage, and zero is distress. Would they have okay, a this rage is... one? This is the challenge one because this is eight. This is ooh. Oh yeah. Ooh. Oh. <laughs> oh, we have such tiny yeah. teeth. Ooh. Look how aggressive. I like that. This is. Uh, no, it doesn't have a zero. And I like is, number nine. Seven is morning. Oh yeah, nine is just get out of here. Nine is scary. Oh my god. That's pretty sick. I can't wait to hear what that sounds like. I'd really like that. I'm going to see if I can get all the sound sets in all honesty. I have some of them, but I don't have all of them. And it looks like they've mm -hmm. done a lot of work to this creature since uh, those days. How do I kill myself? Yippee! <laughs> 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 you did a backflip. <laughs> And that was all the sounds and animations we currently have for the Nurse Dragon, which is now the Brood Watcher. 
Some of the animations and sounds obviously didn't match up, they're still work in progress, and some of the sounds are even in their, like, early couple first passes and they need to be polished up, but it gives you an idea of what they're working on and what they're doing ultimately with it. The backflip that you saw, it was a bug, just to be clear with you, uh, something wasn't set up with collision, uh, but anyways, look at this! Yeah, you can see it pretty clear, um, that there's a glow effect applied even in the day. <laughs> Look like an idiot. <laughs> oh, there's more weather. Oh, what is this? What is this? What is, is this? Like fog? Or windy? Fog. I think it's fog. Mm. Oh, this oh. Is, no, oh, it's sand. Spooky. It's a sandstorm sand? oh, or something. Sand yeah. Oh man, that's. that's Jeez. A, that's intense. It actually makes you want to like leave the area. Yeah, oh, like yeah. it makes you want to hide. Oh shoot. You can see the glow really good too, actually. Spit on me. <laughs> yeah, give me some of that too. More. Give me some of that too. <laughs> oh. She took it. No. Come here. Come back. Salvate. Hurry. Oh. No. No. <laughs> Do it. I'm trying. Do it. Okay. Use your phlegm. <laughs> Reach trying. right back into the throat. Use the oh, phlegm. There it goes. Okay, we're good. <laughs> we're all good. This is this is scary. Uh, these oh. storms are really good. Yeah, that is that is a really cool Ooh. effect. I thought it was like just foggy for a second. <laughs> I thought it was fog too. They've done a really good job fine tuning the weather systems and making them look aesthetically pleasing. They are bar none incredible looking as far as I'm concerned. That sandstorm was sick. We decided that after we wanted to enter a cave, we had a little bit of help from our little bio dragon friend there, made us glow, and there was no dynamic lighting coming off of us. That's not set up yet, but it is planned, just to be clear with you. After messing around with that, because I didn't want to really take too much time showing you that if there was nothing that was going to happen, we decided we wanted to go down to the pond because there was some really cool stuff in the middle of the pond that we wanted to take a look at. Oh my god, you look so cool from a distance. Oh, the water looks Ooh, a little bit questionable. Yeah, it, it always has, though. It's the poop juice. No, you're not down in poop juice. Okay, you are down here. We flew in down to the big juice. pond. Oh, okay, the poop juice. Yeah, down to the poop juice pond. <laughs> the trees look nice, though. There's, like, little rose things and stuff here. Wait, there's petals falling and stuff? There's, like, VFX over there? Yeah, look, come see. There's there's little oh, petals cool. falling. That kind of oh, that's cute. Oh, yeah, there is. Why me, is like... this one so red? It's like cherry blossoms. Um, Why is that tree so red? I think is that a bug? <laughs> um, <laughs> it looks like it's a giant vein tree or something. Ew. Uh, oh wow, that is really pretty though with all the all the leaves and stuff. Oh, I'm pretty sure we can actually like walk into the poop juice. Oh no, wait, we can't. It's wait, no, we can. But it has yeah. underwater effects. <laughs> okay. We just stink to the bottom. Yep. You, you stink to the bottom. Yeah, we stink to the bottom. <laughs> I'm gonna try and fly my way out of the water because I'm just. Oh, that was terrible. Hey, hey Prim, come here and smell my finger. She doesn't know me. Let me just. Let me just. <laughs> make sure that I get that out of my editing real quick. Okay, so, anyways. <laughs> you accidentally leave that in. Yeah, that'd be, that'd be something. <laughs> So anyways, we still have some stuff to show you. We're gonna move over to the arches now and check out that area and some new weather effects. See, I was a little bit too shy to ask for uh, some weather changes, so I just had Brim do it. And, uh, well, lucky enough, yeah. Ooh, no, I don't feel though. guilty for asking for stuff. You're oh my god, you literally- <laughs> Aw, <Aww>, you're terrible. <laughs> oh, look at that. Ask and you will receive, I guess. What is this? Is this fog? Uh, this this is actual yeah. fog, I think. This is- wow. Yeah, this, this is- yeah, this is fog. Wow, flying through this looks so cool. Yeah. Oh, that is, and you look up at the sun and it's like, it's all just almost blurred out. 3D, I need you to spit on me. I'm curious <laughs> yeah, to see I'm, what happens in the, uh, in this fog. I'm trying to just fly. <laughs> land, let <laughs> me see you land. You like your mouth is dried up when you're talking. <laughs> I'm trying to land, I just want to fly. I'm not <laughs> spitting can we, can we get out of the lag forest? <laughs> can't handle it. You know, it looks kind of good though when you're flying from up above and not suffering from a bad GPU. Oh, is it oh snowing? it's snowing now. Snow. He set it up to be a blizzard. It's, oh. I just shivered just looking at that. I don't know why. Wait, where did you both go? Oh well, we're over by the uh, the the fancy trees again. A lag forest. We made our way through a fairly intense blizzard in all honesty uh, ignore me flying underwater there <laughs> and eventually we decided we wanted to go up towards the waterfalls again and really just see what this weather looked like to the entire world 
Along the way, however, we came across Jayo, Super Rhino, and we couldn't really resist messing with him for at least a second. <laughs> 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 You like our throat flaps? <laughs> move a little bit closer and do it again. Now that we've had our fun, it's time for us to move on to the last few cool things remaining. We took some time to admire the drake with its new bioluminescence found through the bio dragon itself and the special attack that it has now. We also went through a little bit of a day-night cycle change. It looked pretty cool to see it in real time, check out the night vision, and in general just messed around. There wasn't too much though that was done with this creature aside of, you know, the cool effects that you can see right now. So we're just gonna kind of skip past it because I want to move right into a cave. Oh, wait, I almost completely forgot about this. We were running around just before we went to the cave and we found this like weird blocked off area. When you look at it, it looks like a rock was purposely put there last second and it, like it has a weird seam and it doesn't, it looks out of place almost. And inside Inside there, there's this weird like, it's almost like a portal effect and there's crystals around it, like some kind of power source or something. And we tried and we tried and we tried to get in there. We had zero luck, but I was able to glitch through every now and again in the, in the with the camera or whatever and like get a look down and it definitely looks like there's some kind of portal that they blocked off at the very last second. I tried to get in there, we weren't able to get in there. Kinda sucked, but it was what it was. Let me know what you think that is down below in the comment section because we're almost sure that that's supposed to be some kind of portal. It's no way it's just water draining down in there with crystals and stuff and the way that that effect looks. <laughs> Your name just instantly went down. All right, let's run in here and see what this is all about. So there's wow. crystals. What else is there? More crystals. Oh my God, I belong here. This is kind of fancy. This goes to the other. <gasps> I think they mentioned something. Oh, wow. Oh, I need to live here. This is where I belong. I think Goodbye. they mentioned something about this place and like the uh, the lighting wow. was still being worked on too. Look at us glowing, like extra glowy. Oh, this is so cool. Look this at these quartz cool. crystals. No, no. Cool. No, 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 no. This is Shay's palace. What is uh, <laughs> Shania Twain's home? Where, uh, what is, what is this down here? <laughs> Oh, there's more. Oh, there's an exit. There's an exit here. Oh, that's a small cave. Hmm. It was the biggest we've seen so far. So you've made it to the end of the video and you've made it to a reward as well because you're here, you deserve to have a reward. I think I forgot to mention the skin that this guy has right now that looks all beautiful and nice and cool. This is one of the creator skins. And to my knowledge, I think each dragon has its own level of creator skin or something custom with creators that they can give away. Uh, I'm going to be giving away my creator skins and I'll be doing that by selecting random people, that's you, who comment on this video, except you are going to comment, Day of Dragons Be Awesome. That will automatically enter you and I will respond to people in the comments section, get your Twitter information or however to contact you and get you those skin codes once I have them. And then on launch day, you'll have a, uh, a cool, pretty looking skin like this one or I don't know, something different for a different dragon. All that aside, I do want to land real quick because there is, uh, there we go, a brand new UI system. I don't think I went down through this, so I'm going to do it real quick. We have our vitals, all this stuff, the temperature, the region we're in, the comfort level of our dragon and the, and the climate that it's in, and then the time, basically. We move on, dragon pearls. Dragon pearls are just like the upgrades and stuff you can get. Some of you guys know about them already. I'm not too knowledgeable in them, so I'm not going to go too far into it. Move down again. Mutations are all still here. Still work in progress, obviously, so don't take this as like the final product or anything by any means. Egg crafting is under development to my knowledge, and genetics right here will show you your parents and, uh... I guess just, in general, the lineage of where you came from to get the traits that you have. And you have your biology, you know what's going on here, and all this stuff pretty much. It's pretty self-explanatory as far as that goes. And that is the new UI system. And closing out, I'm going to be completely transparent with you. This build felt a lot buggier than the last time we visited this game to see exclusive content. To its benefit, these were mainly just goofy bugs that will clearly be fixed before launch. When you take a step back and combine everything we've seen over the development of this game, I think when we finally get our hands on this in 2024, it'll be a pretty okay game. And you know, I'll take pretty okay because it should only get better with time. I mean, let's be honest. This is the only notable game of its type that's near release too. We will cross those hurdles one road at a time. But for now, I'm leaving pretty satisfied 
and hopeful for 2024 when this releases and is in your hands. Thank you for watching, everyone. Leave a like if you did enjoy this video. Let me know your thoughts down below in the comment section. As always, hope you caught the giveaway for those fancy creator skins, and I will see you in the next one.